Hello and welcome. With this show, we will explore the world of entertainment, from magicians and acrobats to live bands. Believe nothing you see on this show and expand your thinking. There are no real psychics and there is no real magic. Only believe what you can see. Are we live? No, we're not. But anytime we have a magician as a special guest, we will only use different camera angles and no trick camera work or trick editing. Everything you see will be as if you were here, live and in person. And now... Now we have Brett and Shane, just playing four.
you doing? She <laughs> can't hear me. She's in a box. <laughs> Nice for the magic of Jeff Cardell. Woo! Pack house here tonight. Pack house. Pack house. That's great. Well, as Jill said, my name is Jeff Cardell. So before we get started, I need to get a little help from the audience. Let's see. Let's raise the house lights up here. Uh, you, ma'am, you'll be good. Come up here and help me. Yay! Okay. Hi. What is your name? Kathy. Kathy. I'm Jeff. I'm a little different than most guys, Kathy. I have three nuts. But before you get offended here, let me explain. Okay? Three nuts, right? So one goes in the hand, two goes in the hand, and one goes in the pocket. So how many nuts in the hand? Two. No, see, most people would say that, but there's actually three. Let's try again. One in the hand, two in the hand, one in the pocket. How many left here? Yeah, you just, no, three. Okay, let's, let's get a little confusing. We'll try this again. We'll take one, put it in the pocket, two, one in the hand, two goes in the pocket. How many is in the hand? One. No, see, there's two, one in the pocket. Uh -huh. We'll try it again. There's one goes there, two goes here. How many's here? Two. Correct. Since you did that so well, we'll take the one, put it in there, take this one and put it in my pocket. How many's here? One. Correct. One great big nut. Yeah. Okay. You want to do another one? Stay up here, Kathy. We're doing good. You want me to show you a trick that drove uh, 14,000 psychiatrists crazy? Sure. Sure. Here it is, the crazy man's handcuffs. Well, they don't call it the crazy man's handcuffs because it drove psychiatrists crazy because it would just be crazy to use these as handcuffs, okay. right? So what you do is you hook the rubber bands in together and they're locked, correct? Mm -hmm. No matter how hard you try to pull them, either way you do it, they're locked. But if you rub it just like that, you see what happens, they come apart. Here, I'll show you one more time. Maybe okay. we can get it from this angle here. Right. See, no matter, you can't go that way, you can't go that way, or even up that way. But if you rub it together just like that, you see it comes. Well, that's kind of neat. Here, I want you to put your <laughs> fingers together just like that and hold on to this rubber band. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Link, link them in there. Just kind of curl that around there okay. and curl that around there. So you're going to be the other handcuff. So again, it won't come across that way even if you try to pull it. But if you try to rub it like that, it comes all the way through. Just, well, holy cow. <laughs> and that's what drove 14,000 psychiatrists crazy. Yay! And they're like, yeah. Oh, hey. oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, let's just keep going. What the heck? Okay, we're ready. Kathy, hi. hi. Ready to see another card trick? I sure am. All right, here we go. I need you to cut the cards about halfway down. Okay. And my pet deck, Gus, is going to show us a little trick. Look at the card. Show the cameras, if you would, the card that you selected. That is good. Perfect. Place it back down there. Okay. What we do is we give the cards a cut just like this, and Gus tells me what your card is. And Gus says, <laughs> I'm not ready. I guess he's got a little stage fright. So what we need to do is get Gus ready. Uh, ask Gus if he's ready. Are you ready, Gus? Let's see what he says. He says yes. Good. Okay. Give the cards a cut again, deep down. Pick up all the cards, place them on top. There you go. Perfect. Look at that card, show the camera. There you go, everybody see. Perfect, place it back down there. Okay, okay we'll give the cards another cut just like this. And Gus should tell us what your card is. Oh, he says ask for a selection of cards. Oh. oh, okay. So what we do is we give you a selection of cards, just like that. Oh, no, so you want them face down. Oh. You get a little picky sometimes. So what I'll do is I'll lay some cards face down. Pick any one of those cards and look at it. Show the camera. Okay. okay. Lay some all back in here. Now Gus is going to tell us what your card is. Okay. He says, give me a hand. Oh, come, come on, on, Gus. This is crazy. <laughs> okay, give him a hand. Was it black or red? 
black. Black, great. Is it a club or a spade? That's that's going too far. Well, we'll give the. I got a prediction in my pocket. And the prediction starts off as a blank card. Okay. okay? And what we do is we take the prediction and put it through Gus just like this, and he should tell us what your card is. What was your card, by the way? Six of clubs. The six of clubs. That's right, Gus. Oh. Did a great job. That's Thank great. you, Gus. Gus. Yay. Yay. Hi. Hi. 
How would you like to see my pet dick, Gus? <laughs> sure. Say that real quick. Okay. Yeah.